Kia ora, it's Miss Heather here. I'm the Within School Kahui Ako leader. Here we are doing maths as a word problem, so you won't see numbers on the board. It is a physical word problem. I chose this word problem because I knew that the children could only count up to 40 and I wanted to extend them. Now the word problem will be around experience, what the children have experienced at school and at home. So the word problem itself, the children have to have a conversation about it. The children were focusing on active listening. During active listening, they have to turn and talk. They have to agree to write down the shared thinking or ideas. They have to problem solve together. They have to do this continuously right throughout the word problem until they feel like it is enough for them to have solved it. Again, they've got to go back, they've got to look at what they've done and they've got to make their thinking make sense. Later on, they'll be sharing their thinking with the class with the guidance of the teacher. When the children are stuck, this is a chance for the teacher to refocus the group. The problem is relaunched again. Children are able to ask questions just to clarify their thinking. They are encouraged to turn and talk to each other again before they go off onto their own with their buddies. Once it's been solved, then the lesson stops. Together with the teacher, the group that solved it, they'll explain it to the class. The children will explain their thinking. In this case, the children counted all the chairs one by one. Now this gives the teacher an opportunity to either extend their thinking or perhaps continue to strengthen where they're at at the moment. All right, Fano. now here's the word problem. You give it a go. Don't forget to turn to the person that's next to you and share your thinking with them. All right, good luck. <laughs>